Guess who was Bowser coining? Hey, hello everyone, and welcome back to the walkthrough. Metro Kingdom is good. And. And. Loading screen. <laughs> but yeah, it won't take long, don't you worry. And uh, the reason why I was getting a bunch of coins is because the outfits now are getting sort of on the pricey side, so I thought. Mm, Probably should do a couple of runs along there and just, yeah, just kind of grab some coins ahead of time, grab some outfits, make some coins back. I'm sure I'll make some coins back as I'm exploring stuff via Balloon World and whatnot. So anyway, uh, I should probably go in the golden door for the golden half of the shop. Oh, yes! Hmm, 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 man, there's still a lot. <laughs> a lot. Well, well, hmm, I mean, I, I guess in theory I don't have to do them all, but I don't know, I just keep changing things up as I go. <laughs> all right, let's go ahead and be all pretty for our future wedding. Yeah! <laughs> now, we can go ahead and Luigi it up. Woo! I wonder if this is a slight replica of the Lock Lady dress. Well, obviously, you know, slightly different measurements as determined before, but still. But still, hmm. Could be. Anyway, Luigi! Whoa, bro, you're getting married? And you didn't tell me? <laughs> Oh, oh, you're just swearing off the... Oh, for, for, like, fun, huh? Oh, oh hey, hey, you wanna connect in there? Yes, I do. <laughs> just, like, change the subject. Oh, yeah. I shouldn't have gone down the road of marriage. <laughs> Got 34 coinages. Yeah, we should probably hide it. Starting point is... Low this time. Oh, man. Why? I'm not sure, actually. Probably to make things interesting with all the climbing, acrobatics, and stuff like that, I suppose. I don't know. I don't know. And it's also raining, though it's not, like, pouring rain during the Koopa race or during the takeover by Bowser's minions and stuff like that. But anyway, I'm thinking... I was going to say, I'm thinking, as long as the cars don't get in my way, I'm going to go roll out the barrel over to the beginning. Don't smack your face on that. Thank you for stopping there, Mr. Car. And we're going up. And we're going in here. <laughs> it's kind of where a moon was, but the thing about it is that... I want to do it very efficiently to kind of give a little bit of a challenge. And that worked out pretty nice. Alright, let's find stuff. What should we find? Uh, is that at the park? Can't even see where... Oh, I see it. It's in the tree. See that little sparkle? Alright, I think I could probably pull it off in 35 seconds. 3, 2, 1... As a matter of fact... Wah! I think that's a bit faster. <laughs> and... Well, I think, that, I think that roll was unnecessary. <laughs> I think that, that roll might have slowed me down to boot. Yeah, we're fine, we're fine. And... Yeah! Racking up those coinages for our next outfit. Uh, mm, what's, look at nice and flat so we don't have to go ridiculously high, I guess. I guess I'll go for Peach. Maybe she has forgiven us. I mean, I mean we, we have forgiven us. I mean, forgiven her for leaving us behind. I don't know. And yeah, Mario doesn't, Mario doesn't seem that sad about her or anything like that anyway. <laughs> It's oh, it's in here. Uh, figures, little extra timages, little poppages to keep our streak going, and hopefully not miswording things in the future again. <laughs> All right, heck yeah! Um, cupcake. Oh, I must have the cupcake. <laughs> Actually, was that the same one? I just played because the first one is gone? I think so, yeah. 
Uh, this is up on top of the cafe area. 29 seconds to do that? Eh, eh, I guess it's maybe possible, probably. I don't think that's like way off like any higher than the arrow is implying. So we're gonna go ahead and see if I got this right. So we're gonna go around and try this path. And ooh, yeah, go! And, oh, oh four, wait, four? Oh, okay, I was gonna say! <laughs> Just couldn't see with the umbrella in my way. All right, my prediction was right-ish. <laughs> <laughs> Woo, I thought I was gonna actually be on the other roof, but no. Uh, you know, the roof off to the left side, but then when I seen the... I was getting closer as I popped out of the power line, yeah. Uh, ooh. Ooh. That's probably way on top, top of the building. Uh, I'm not so sure I'd make it up there in 40 seconds. <laughs> Even with the powers of the power line. Uh, that's, oh, that's another one up top, looks like. What is Jonas? Is that over by... I was just say, is it over by that build? No, it couldn't be over by that building. Way on, uh... Because you have to go inside a building to make it to that building way off on the other side. Anyway. What it is?! That... You can't go in here that... Uh, um... Uh, there's gotta be some trick to this. <laughs> Am I supposed to go like, yeah? Well, maybe that's what I'm supposed to do, but not from the location that I did it. Oh, I should have just restarted. <laughs> okay, so I, I guess I should try and get all the way up to the tippy top where that cafe was. Probably, assuming that I can do this smooth enough here. Go! Don't hit your face. Don't hit your face. We, can, we don't have much time to hit your face. <laughs> and homing attack. All the way up here. That's higher than I was before, I think. And... Maybe I'll try it off the table. Let go. Ten seconds. Oh, shoot. I was like, ooh. Oh, oh. Huh, oh. No, that's <laughs> that's not even close, actually. So I don't know about that one. That's my best guess is to go on top of that building. But then again, I didn't think I could make it. Or I, I mean, I was questioning if I could make it to that sign back over at the Cap Kingdom. So maybe I'll give it one more shot here. Oh shoot, I shouldn't have. <laughs> as I say, I shouldn't have taken that. That particular angle, but oh, oh no! <laughs> now I have a decent amount of time when I actually make it to the top top. It's just a map. Maybe not if I do that. <laughs> but what I wanted to do was long jump off the railing. <clears throat> oh wait 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 no no no! <laughs> That's not gonna work. I just did a regular jump because I didn't have enough slide. And uh, jeez. Alright, one more try, one more try. Go! Don't hit your face, don't hit your face. And, okay. Yeah, this is like my only idea as to where. Unless I'm able to go. Wait, actually, I got an I another idea here. Because the, t the time stop. I was gonna say the time stops when I go out with those. Yeah, the guys, but actually, no, I don't think I'd be able to make it. Ooh! Uh, oh, mm, I don't know. <laughs> There's gotta be some trick to it, but it's not not off that railing. Yeah, I know I didn't go to the other railing that time, and I don't know. I thought maybe the angle is nah, different balloon. I I, I need to be able to afford outfits in the future. <laughs> I just inflated that reward. Um, let's see here. Um, it looks like it's in a different location. That may be where my balloon is, <laughs> based on the... It does look like it is inside that, uh... Uh, see that? Yeah! Alright, let's do it! Go, 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 go! If we know where it is, let's go for it! Let's see how hard it is to actually execute this. Probably not all that, all that hard. <laughs> and go! Switch the camera to... Ooh, oh, it's not actually in it, it's behind it. Alright, like, you know, I could have even done a dive to save even more time there, but... Eh, we're okay. 
Alright, 71, we got a smidge back in the 70s, a little, a little giblet back compared to what I lost at that Super Mario World moon that's behind this building, and oh, that's probably where Captain Toad is. You know, I say that a lot, but that just seems to be where things roll, you know? Alright. Just go ahead and go around this way then, I suppose. It doesn't matter which way I go around, just that I think there's less opposition this way. Yeah, it is down by Captain Toe, just as long as we are quick enough to... Oh man, I was gonna say, quick enough to get the time bonus, but maybe I should've just walked off the edge instead of trying to... ground pound of... Eh, mm, mm. Sometimes I get too fancy, or I attempt to get too fancy for my own good. Time bonus, 14 more... And... Uh, that's... oh. No, that's different than the one I was doing, wasn't it? I think so. Yeah, I, I think it is, because the, the time is different. So I'm gonna presume it's on that building again. <laughs> so I'm gonna just do it here, because now that I have more time, I just wanna see if this is actually possible. It is using the powers of the forks, getting ourselves up to the very tippy top and then going ahead and or at least attempting to jump from the top of this building over to the building way off to the side although I might be going in a totally totally convoluted direction here uh, is that correct hold on I just want to see the arrow that looks right and we go I say we go <laughs> we don't go that way, I guess. Alright, so... Well, I, I can obviously make it up there, and I think I would be able to make that jump if I, uh... uh if I actually would have been able to get over the railing! Maybe what I should have done was, uh, walked along the edge of the railing instead. And, yeah. Let's try that. Go, 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 go! It, and, you know, long jumped off the edge of the railing instead of trying to long jump over the railing. Kind of takes out the... the the height factor of the long jump, fa yeah, the factors, stuff and stuff, and and I'm a lot smoother getting up, here, getting up here than I was during the Koopa race. <laughs> I don't know why I had so much difficulties with that. All right, now we're gonna go like this, and we're gonna go just angle it straight and nice here before we get get. Oh, well, actually, I can do it off of here. It doesn't matter. <laughs> and this looks like how we're supposed to do it. Four, three, probably in the tree, right? Oh, oh. <laughs> yeah, it's in the tree. <laughs> but yeah, I don't know how I would be able to even do that if I was, you know, that other balloon. Unless it's one of those ones that people cheated. Who knows? Who knows? <laughs> I never like to use the word cheat like right off the bat because there, there's sometimes some things you just don't know that some people can do or that it is actually possible to do. I should say. And sometimes you just don't think of it. Um, that's probably on the scaffolding in front of the park, of which I should be able to use a power line to get up to relatively smoothly. I think because there's one. Oh no, it's not. Where is this look? <laughs> Where is this located? Then is it back near the beginning? Because that's yeah, that is actually pretty far for. Oh, I see it. I should be able to make it there in 10 seconds, even if I dilly-dally. But, you know, time bonuses and stuff like that, I just do what I don't want to miss out on anything. Like, do a poor long jump or get all fancy like I do the ground pound. Yay! Coin profits! Holy moly! Big time coin profits! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, and... Um, I really don't know how to scale this building at top speed. <laughs> like, I, I just don't know how that, how that even works. And it just looks like when, they're, when the arrows are pointing straight up, it's or near straight up, it's right at the top of the building, I'm thinking. Uh, I mean, I could try one that's straight up, like with maximum coinages, but I, I don't know where the closest power line is. I'll, I'll try it just because it's only 10 coins. Uh, 
Well, maybe what I could do is go to that building and then go over, like, long jump to there, use that power line, and then go straight up that away. Maybe? I, I don't know. I'm, but I'm pretty sure there's something over here. Like, if I were to go... Yeah, here. is This is one option, I think. Like, you do that, and then you actually jump to... Oh. <laughs> you should jump to this one. Then you're able to go up to here. Oh, maybe that is the shortest pathway. So, okay. So it's probably all the way up to... Shoot. Grab onto the edge. I, I, I say, no, no, turn around? Okay. <laughs> okay, so I guess I do know the relatively short path to get there. <laughs> all right. Yay. Woohoo. So I guess it's not that hard to actually get a balloon even up to the top of that to boot. Oh, that, oh, that reminds me. I bet you could long jump from up on top of that spire to the building way out that away in that 26 seconds one or whatever it was. Can I replay that? I don't know which one. <laughs> I don't know which one that was though. Someone might have already gotten it. Yeah, I think it's already already been collected. I don't see. Yeah, that one's aiming at a, a higher location. Oh man! <laughs> so it has been popped. They figured it out before I did. <laughs> probably speedrunners getting that. Um, let's do one more here. Sra, let's try it. It looks like it's off at the corner of the city, fairly level. So we're gonna go... Pro it's probably on the billboards and stuff like that behind this building here, so I'm gonna go up over here. Use the stairs. Oh, 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 oh. I say, I'm gonna go up here, use the sta... Or I'm not. <laughs> okay, where... Where is my suspicions pointing? How did you get it in there?! Um... <laughs> uh, can you scooch on underneath here? So what? Did you clip that? How did you clip that in there? <laughs> can I sneak a hat in there, maybe? <laughs> I don't, I don't understand. <laughs> I'll try it one more time just for kicks. But yeah, I don't, I'd have, I'd like to have to try a couple more things to try and get something in there that touched the balloon, I suppose. <laughs> I was about right where it was. Like, I mean, I, I was, but, no shoot. I was gonna say it was at the billboards, but not, not the billboards on this side. It was the billboards over here. Okay, I'm gonna try path throw down. Won't let me throw my hat down. Can I get my hat to sneak inside here? Can I get my butt? Ooh, ooh! Uh, no, I don't think. I, I don't know. I don't think I can get my body in there. <laughs> yeah, that's. Uh, I'm a little stumped by that. <laughs> that's okay, though. I'm, I think I did enough ballooning. For one day. Oh yeah, 328 baby! Woo! Yeah, I'm ready. My streak was broken anyway <laughs> from that one. Uh, I don't know, I'm gonna have to play with trying to get in there off camera or something like that and see. Yay! I got popped! What did I get? What did I get? Oh, is that... Did I already get the reward from Luigi? I, I don't know. Or is that just alerting me? That's I could put another balloon there. I don't know. But what I do know is it's brochure time. <laughs> Metro Kingdom, Modern Commerce Center, and Urban Playground. Playground is right. You can do so much jumping around here. New Dong City, a city, the city that never leaps. Get it? Get it? Oh, ho, ho, New York never sleeps. Yes. Anyway, population <laughs> crowded indeed. Size ridiculous. <laughs> Donkey Kong. Locals and new donkers, of course. Currency, portrait stamps, you know, Pauline in the uh, city hall, industry, information, and ads. Temperature, definitely run around nude. And new donk city hall and Mayor Pauline. 
Scraping the sky. The skyscrapers of New Dong City are most people's first association with the city. <laughs> but even the, even among those, New Dong City Hall stands out as the very symbol of this great city, so don't miss it. Who knows? You might even run into world-renowned Mayor Pauline. She, she just stands in the middle of wherever. It, it, it's kind of hard to miss her if you're wandering around. <laughs> Fun tidbit, RC cars. More new dongers are getting into the noble spot. I mean, normal sports of RC car racing. Find a local enthusiast and you'll open up a whole new world. The nighttime skyline shines from any angle. Ooh, ah, a million coin view. If you've come to New Dong City, you owe it to yourself to see it at night. And we have in the storm during a festival. <laughs> so that like before night with Luigi. The best viewing spot is the landmark New Dong City Hall, but sadly, the interior is closed for construction. And it's perpetually in construction, <laughs> so you'll have to aim for one of the neighboring buildings. Unless... unless you want to deal with the bugs if, and dangers. If it's festival season, you'll have a chance at a once-in-a-lifetime experience. But the timing is a bit irregular, so be sure to check the schedule beforehand and make sure you can transform your body into 8-bits. Crazy Cap Flagship Store. There's probably only one brand that the entire world knows, and that's Crazy Cap. Their original flagship store is right here in New Donk City and also makes these brochures. The unique storefront is converted from an old theater. Theater space is no longer much in demand with so many speed performers in the city. The most world's most trusted brand in headwear. Well, what about the body wear? You know, there's all sorts of suits you can wear, too. And I don't think you can get them anywhere else, so... So, I don't know, I think they're... I think it's just talking... Well, I guess head caps are their, their main product, they're saying. Always be constructing! There aren't even safety rails. <laughs> new donkers are used to construction and new developments. There are always work. There's always work being done below ground, on rooftops, and inside buildings. So power lines never get taken down. Uh, they kind of were, unless it was due to Bowser's doing. <laughs> they run throughout town. Unaccustomed travelers should watch it out for the cranes, girders, and manholes scattered everywhere. Scooting across town. These motor scooters may look old-fashioned, but they pack a punch and are perfect for tooling around the city. Be sure to try one out. They are also more fuel-efficient than your typical car. Tougher than it looks. <laughs> no kidding. Three keys to the kingdom. Always three keys. But will we get the key to the city? Probably not. One, appreciate the constant Power Moon base progress and development, but you gotta go on the stinky sewers. Visit those welcoming souls who just leave their doors wide open. Participate in citywide festival. So in the citywide festival, excuse me, if you can. Schedule something to change depending on if there's a Donkey Kong running loose or if there's a Bowser running loose. Done by the Crazy Cap Store. Alright! <laughs> And with that, I'm going to end off the part here. Uh, I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next part when I stop spinning this camera. Eh, probably, maybe. Eh, I don't know, this is kind of fun. <laughs>